grateful manner. Being grateful and saying thank you. Our God Allah has given us so many blessings and favors that we can't count them all. Our Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, taught us not to look at those who have more wealth or status than us, because it can lead us to be ungrateful and not appreciate all the blessings and favors Allah has given us. Instead, we should compare ourselves to those who have less than we have, so that we can recognize all that Allah has given us and become more grateful. Gratitude can strengthen our faith, make us more righteous, and get us closer to Allah. Gratitude is the key to Allah's rewards and pleasure. Being thankful will also cause our blessings and favors to be increased. The more we are grateful, the more Allah will give us. We should feel thankful in our hearts, and we should show it with our tongue when we speak. We should get in the habit of always thanking Allah for all that He has given by saying Alhamdulillah, which means praise and thanks be to Allah. We should also say other words of appreciation to Allah, our parents, and others who help us or deserve our thanks. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, taught us that when we hear good news, whether it's something we gained or some harm that we have avoided, we should fall in sujood to Allah to show our thankfulness and appreciation to Allah. This was something that Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, used to do. You don't have to face Qibla or be in wudu to fall in sujood. We should also express gratitude by doing good deeds. An excellent way to show appreciation to Allah is by obeying Him and praying to Him. Another way of showing gratitude to Allah is by practicing patience during difficult times, which is actually a test by Allah to see if we are still grateful during a tough time. Being generous to others. 